Does your Incheon International Airport look like this or this? How about this? Or does it look like this? If you frequent South Korea, Zero Dollar Payware has you covered with this free improvement to the nation's largest airport. Welcome to Flight Brothers FT. I'm Lee, and in this video, we will look at the details brought to X-Plane 11 with this freeware add-on. Welcome to Flight Brothers FT, produced by Tim and Lee. Plan the flight and fly the plan. All charts courtesy of Navigraph Charts, not to be used for real-world navigation. Be sure to subscribe and explore the rest of the channel for high-quality aviation content and entertainment. 안녕하세요. Let's briefly look at the default scenery as a point of reference, then we'll see what Zero Dollar gives us. We have cargo aprons, fuel tanks, and looking south-southeast across runways 15 left and right. Ortho, for the main island the airport sits on, is included in addition to the airport itself. The airport contains mostly custom buildings, somewhat accurate layout and signage. This is their words, not our, uh, not mine. Uh, pretty good FPS optimization, realistic 3D grass and ortho, reasonably functional custom SAM jetways, accurate grunge and dirt, and high resolution 1K textures with PBR. It also contains a accurate terminal interior layout and is unofficially licensed by the Incheon International Airport Cooperation and BTS. Of note, this video was produced in December 2021 and January 2022. Newer versions of X-Plane, uh, the version you're seeing on screen is 11.52, include all four runways. Zero dollar includes runway 33 left and right and 34 right, and the opposing 15 left and right and 16 left. Runway 34 left, 16 right is under construction with the included ortho in this scenery. They do plan to include this newly completed runway in a future version. The default runway 16 right, 34 left is represented in the default XP and includes some rougher taxiway renditions seen on the right looking down runway 16 right. This view shows 34 left under construction as we look to the north. To check the operation of ILS 34 left, you join me here in the Torque Sim SR22 Turbo Normalized. With current nav data, you can successfully fly the ILS, but the scenery doesn't support, which I will use air quotes, the actual landing. Contained in the instructions with the airport, you must install a modified version of the airport data for the scenery to work with some payware aircraft. And because of the newly opened runway while they were in development, they were unable to implement it into this version of the scenery. Please check that information in the video description below. Worth noting, in this aircraft around this scenery, I typically found frame rates around the low to mid 20 frames per second, but didn't really experience any stutter or hardships with my low to mid grade hardware. In the next screenshot, we'll take a look at the default scenery and then migrate through numerous screenshots with the zero dollar payware add-on. The first two images you're seeing are of the same area. They include the fire department trainer, multiple custom buildings surrounding the airport along with the ortho, an accurately modeled cargo ramp. Here you can see Incheon with the ortho, much more appealing than the default version. Numerous nav aid buildings, including the VOR down to our bottom left, and a close up of the custom VOR. Numerous parking lots scattered throughout the airport environment. Again, we have catering and cargo buildings contained throughout, and terminal buildings that are fairly authentic and believable. Internal structures are also modeled. Here you can see seating areas along with uh, windows and some color tent 
people movers, again more seating as we look throughout the terminals, and each of the terminals are modeled in a similar fashion as you see here. Various airport markings and signage throughout seem to be accurately rendered. Here we have the Korean Air Cargo Building, as well as accurate taxiway lines and markings. Here's a shot of the other terminal. It looks lovely how they did the texturing, and even in various parts you'll find these uh, cargo loaders scattered around. Again, we take a look at Terminal 1 and the Asiana Cargo Hub. Grass and texturing throughout is also very believable and well done, and you do see some reflective PBR lighting features uh, throughout as well. Next we will explore the details of Terminal 1, but these details carry throughout the scenery. You have glass that you can see through. Sometimes this is a texture issue depending on who the developer is, but you can functionally see uh, through both sides here. You have people moving walkways. Further up ahead here you'll see images on the storefronts. Uh, while repetitive, uh, they do appear to use just a handful of images. Uh, they are present. There's a roof texturing also you can uh, see throughout the concourse above us here and these light stand modules I guess that are modeled throughout we'll head up here and then turn down one of the concourse and get a look through there just to show you uh, how the concourse look And as we've seen some images, the cargo areas are accurately recreated throughout the airfield environment here with the INI Builds A300. And here's a flyover of the airport, so you can take a look at the included custom buildings. Uh, this gives me a very authentic reminder of what this airport felt like, uh, though I must admit it's been about 15 years since I was personally here. I'm sure much has changed in that time, but it is, it's a very nice looking airport with uh, an impressive and uh, modern design elements still. As I mentioned earlier, uh, there will be links to announcements of this scenery, uh, the scenery link itself, uh, general information, and the required scenery libraries uh, will be provided in the video description below. There are two libraries, the Mr. X Library V2.0 Plus and the SAM V2.0 Plus to round out the scenery installation. If you spend any time simming in Asia and specifically South Korea, you can't miss with the installation of the $0 payware Incheon International Airport. As an X-Plane pilot, the addition of ortho in the terminal area helps greatly with immersion. With the many custom buildings and having been here personally, for me, this is a must have. Please check the video description below to get your RKSI. Thanks for joining me today and always remember to plan the flight and fly the plane. If you enjoy this content, consider buying us a coffee to show your support. Visit us at buymeacoffee.com slash flightbrosft or search for us from the menu if you'd like to contribute. A link will be provided in the video description below.